Sydney Style and welcome back to my A to Z trend guide. So through this series, we've been breaking down all the hottest trends from Fashion Week from A to Z and showing real life ways to wear them. So today we're at the letter M. M is for mod. So the 60s are back in a major, major way. This doesn't mean you should go to your local thrift store and dress from head to toe 60s. So the trick to retro style is doing a little bit of the past and a little bit of the present. So a really popular dress in the 60s was a shirt dress like this one. Um, black, shift style, little white collar. So a lot of the cool girls, the it girls in the 60s wore this style. Um, during fashion week, I paired this dress with pumps, but for fall, I wanted to do a little black boot. And since I have some ease for embellishments on my collar, I really don't need much jewelry, so I just did some crystal rings. If you're not a fan of the straighter shift style dress, the A-line shape was also really, really popular in the 60s. Also a big trend in the decade were bold graphic prints, a lot like this skirt right here. So I brought out the print with a bright red top, and since the skirt's on the shorter side, I needed a heavier shoe. So I did brown booties. You could also do knee-high boots or tights if it's colder where you live. Um, and a lot of outfits in the 60s had a bit of a collegiate feel. So I felt like the navy blazer had some schoolgirl vibes going on. Just remember, if you're adding a jacket to an A-line skirt, it needs to be fitted. Otherwise, there's way too much volume going on. So I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts on this mod mod trend. So leave a comment in the section below. You can also ask me your questions about this trend or any of the trends we're covering in this series. And I promise I'll get to them even if I don't get to them immediately. And I wanna see how you are wearing all the trends we're covering in the A to Z trend guide. So throughout the series, we're using the hashtag SS trend guide on social media. And I'm posting my favorites of the week both on Facebook and my newsletter. So if you don't have my newsletter coming to your mailbox yet, go to sydneystyle.com to subscribe and you can see more ways to wear the trends over there. And please subscribe to my YouTube so you can see a new trend guide every Tuesday and Thursday.